The attack occurred on January 5, 2014, at a private mental hospital in Liaoning's capital of Shenyang. Surveillance video shows two male nurses violently beating a patient named Zhao Yanli for over 10 minutes, with several bystanders failing to intervene. After beating Zhao, the nurses left and the bystanders helped the man onto a bed. Zhao is said to suffer from schizophrenia and was hospitalized one day before the attack. The patient became quite emotional after being hospitalized. On the evening of the incident, he verbally abused the nurses on duty. The nurses failed to control their temper and beat the patient. The beating has left Zhao unable to move his arms and legs. He sustained serious injuries to his spine, as well as rib fractures. When we visited Zhao on Monday, he was in a semi-conscious state. Before coming to the hospital, my brother weighed more than 75 kilograms. He could walk by himself and play poker. Zhao's relatives said they didn't receive any information about the beating until they visited him on January 9, 2014. The hospital's vice director said the nurses failed to report the attack. I asked why they didn't inform us or give my brother any treatment. Someone said it was normal, that patients are often treated like this when hospitalized. Zhao's brother reported the beating online in April using a website set up by local authorities after failing to reach an agreement with the hospital regarding treatment and compensation for Zhao. Local health and public security authorities then opened an investigation. Our investigation showed that the hospital violated regulations that forbid employing non-public health technicians, as well as using treatments and medicine that are outside its allowed scope of medical practice. The nurses violated the Professional Ethical Code of Medical Workers. The nurses have been detained by police. The local health department has fined the hospital and ordered it to correct its practices. A court is now reviewing the case, and a final assessment of Zhao's injuries is on the way.